Um, now, do you think uh, your grade point average, what would it be if you oh. could graduate in um, physics and minor in math? Oh, seriously? Maybe 3.78 like this young man, Elliot. No. Um, well, Not that's for me. what he graduated with. But what's so special about Elliot is he's 13 years old. <gasps> What? He's 13 years old. He just graduated from the University of Minnesota with a 3.78 GPA. Now, I have to tell you this. Minoring um, in math, majoring in physics, he wants to be a high-energy <laughs> theoretical physicist, which I thought when I first what? read that, he just wanted to be like, let's do some physics. But no, that's an actual <laughs> thing. Not like high energy. Like he wasn't going to have a high yes. energy. That's why I'm in this job. And thankfully, there's people like Elliot. They're going to lead us lead. forward. Yes, they uh, are. But yeah, he started college when he was nine. He started reading at the age of three and doing a simple math problem. That's so incredible. We will also keep track of Elliot and his future yeah. plans and where he's going. Now, I mm -hmm. always say, because I graduated from high school, an all-girls private Catholic school. Mm -hmm. I don't know why I'm telling you all that, but sure. like as if it matters. No, it's but it's class size of 107. Uh -huh. But I graduated from high school and college, USF, with the same GPA, 3.4. Oh, nice. So I said if I wrote a memoir, it would be barely better than a B by Christine Pilara. <laughs> Ooh, the right? I heard some giggles so back there. Did y'all like that? Yeah, that's good. I'm just barely